Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I'm free. I'm free. Hey, good morning. It's morning here at the Jesus Center, and this is Andrew. And he was the first one who got baptized here at the center, and it was this night. I have a little video where you can see it. It was crazy. It was two o'clock in the night. I heard they were finished. Very short. First question: You had a hard life. Yes, yes, yes. Just okay. from drug addiction to going to jail to to being a thief, still in line. It's um uh, just being distant from everybody. Just being a slave to 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 my addiction. And like I just wanted to be free. <laughs> and they have a, he heard about Jesus to a friend who had yes. taken him in and helping him. And God had really done a lot. And yesterday, we had a meeting here where somebody was sharing about the freedom and the baptism and what Jesus did. And you got baptized. You got yes. delivered. Yes. You received the Holy Spirit, yes. spoken tongues. Just and you said like you. How are you this morning? I feel light as a feather. I feel like there's nothing holding me down no more. All the chains are gone. There's just I'm free. Praise the Lord, I'm free. Hallelujah. How, how was it yesterday? Because you, I can put some clips in here and people can see it was very powerful. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. In the name of Jesus, peace. Peace! Peace! Peace in the name of Jesus! Peace! Peace in the name of Jesus! When I went up to the guy to share his testimony, it was just like, I, I felt like I needed to talk to him because I was, shared a similar story to him. And I asked him, you know, uh, how how do I go about being free? Because, I mean, I, I, I know the Lord, but I don't know how to walk with the Lord. I don't know how to be free. So, like, and he was like, well, come on. And then... They started praying for me, and then, like, I just don't remember pieces of it, but when I came to, there was, like, there was a lot of stuff that left you, and they was like, do you want to be free, free? I was like, yes. It was like, well, then let's go baptize you, and then I just got so excited and so pumped, and <laughs> I'm still excited right now. It's just, um, as soon as they baptized me, it all went blank again, because I, I don't recall anything, but as soon as... The spirit left my body. It was just like freedom. Like the 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 old clothes just got torn off, and like a, a new garment just got put on me, and it was just free, light as a feather. It wasn't heavy. No more heavy clothes. No more heavy burdens. They're all gone. And it was just I started praising the Lord, spoken tongues. I've never done that before. This is the first time, and it was just like. I just felt the Holy Spirit just consume me, and it was just, it was amazing. It was amazing. Thank you, Jesus! Thank you, Jesus! Oh, thank you, Jesus! Thank you, Lord! Oh, yes, thank you, Jesus! <laughs> thank you, Lord! Thank you, Lord! I'm free! I'm free! I'm free. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Oh. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Come on. This is what we read in the Bible. We, in baptism, we put on Christ. We die with Christ. We rise up with Christ. We put on Christ. We wash away our sins. We put off the old man. And then we receive the Holy Spirit, the power of this new life. And this is what he experienced here today. It's not something we just read about in the Bible. It's something that is happening and you experience it. Yes, yes. Like, I didn't... I didn't like I, I knew it was real, but I didn't really like understand it because I, I was like, okay, that's just what I see. Like, but then it happened to me, and it was just like, it's real. There, it, there's nothing fake about this. This is real. Like, the Lord will set you free from anything that's holding you down, and and, and you will become a new person in Christ. And it's just, whew. 
And that was the first baptism we had on this new Jesus Center, and it was in room 120. A good number, 120 people was gathered on Pentecost, and the new church, the new beginning started, and here this is a new beginning. Yes, yes. <laughs> Love it! God bless you!